Hello everyone. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Why Not Wednesdays with your girl, the Bunny Bunny. <laughs> I've had coffee, so I'm a little bit hyper this morning. Well, it's afternoon. I post this at like noon, so but I'm recording in the morning. So your girl's a little bit hype. <clears throat> Today we are playing Mind Scanners. Mind Scanners is a retro futuristic psych I don't know what that word is. It's a simulation, y'all, in which you diagnose the citizens of a dystopian metropolis to locate a host of other unworld otherworldly characters and use arcade style treatment devices to help them. Manage your time and resources to keep the structure I don't know what that is. Imbalance. Decide if you want to keep up the system or go against. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. Um, we're gonna go. <laughs> don't wanna go easy. I don't know what I'm doing, so let's just go easy. <laughs> I, I wonder if this music is copyrighted. I'm gonna be so upset. <clears throat> Greetings, citizens. As you are well aware, your daughter is now in the care of this structure. She has been, oh, okay, I'm, I have, okay. She has been placed in quarantine at the site. My brain is gone. <laughs> Zynuka, Zynuka, I guess, Institute. As she has shown signs of a highly contagious mental illness. What? Mental illnesses are contagious? Is that? I don't think that's. Okay. Details of her condition are classified, but we assure you she is in good hands for, for, for normality and the mind, the structure. I don't know. The structure sounds ghetto. Request to visit your daughter denied. To access the institute. I'm not about to, to fight with this word every time. You must be a mind scanner with a level three citizenship. We understand your concern, but there is no need to worry. For your inconvenience, your daily maintenance is reduced by two cap -pock? Cap -pock? Cap -pock? I don't know. That's That's a different currency. Maybe like a Slavic, um, this looks like it's from like a Slavic lang language. The structure. Congratulations, you've been accepted to the Mind Scanners program. Encloses the needed equipment for the job. This includes a radio phone through which you will receive further instructions. The con constructor thanks you for your service. Okay, normality in the mind, my ass. Oh god. Is this like, um, there's a game called Papers, Please. I have never played it, but this is what it, what it looks like. What it, this, okay. Diagnose and treat non-citizens of the structure. For each completed treatment, you will receive 15k if you, I'm assuming that's supposed to be like a k. Um, I'm just going to say K because that's what it looks like in my brain, so I'm sure that's not what it is, but that's fine. If you can't pay maintenance at the end of the day, you will be exiled from the structure and thrown into the outer zone. What are all these buttons? This, this looks like paper, papers, please. This is what this is like. This is a map of the structure shows the citizens who are showing signs of strange behavior. Look, a citizen is in need of attention. Go pay him a visit. Rutger is Rutger. Why? Is a true nature enthusiast. He knows every tree in the structure and is the chief cons conservator. Right, conservator. But con is it conservator or conservator? Because conservator sounds good. That sounds better in my brain. Of uh, Triangle Park. Lately, he's been 
become more connected in nature. In fact, he believes he is an oak tree. Insanity types. Okay, go, I guess. Swish, swish. Swish, swish. Y'all remember this? This citizen has already been scanned. His insanity amount and insanity types are displayed here. I don't know what them types mean, sir. Start treatment and remove his insanity before the time runs out. Oh, treatment, I guess. What are we doing? Insanity types, okay. What am I supposed to do? Oh. Now I assume that it's supposed to be like based on type or whatever, right? What are we doing? What am I supposed to do? I don't understand anymore now. Oh! They didn't say nothing about this. Got it. Okay. Okay, so you're you can't have too much personality out here on the structure. I'm not an oak tree. No. That's sort of silly, isn't it? I guess I spent too much time with vegetation. I better go visit my friends again. Thank you. Thank you so much. I mean in this case, it's not that it you know, like I don't think anybody should really be thinking they're an oak tree, you know. Again, that's just me. You know, I'm not here to judge you if you believe you're an oak tree or you believe you're an oak tree. But I feel like this is an extreme case of insanity, I guess. Like, because that's what the game is calling it. So don't come for me in the comments. Thank you. This mind scanning is fairly new. The technology is still being tested. But rest assured, our methods are highly effective. No more citizens require your attention today. Get some rest and continue tomorrow. End of day one. Maintenance six dollars. I'm gonna call them dollars because that's what we call them in the U.S. And clearly, I don't think this is supposed to be in the U.S. Your daughter is trapped in a room. We try to unlock the room. The key breaks. She screams. <gasps> oh! Probably not like that, but um. I don't know if you have noticed, my voice is not very high. She's a citizen for a last minute of insanity. Remember, you take 100% responsibility for the diagnosis. What? A writer with a best selling book series, Tales of the Outer Zone. His imagination has led to his session with his own creation. So 50, 60, and 60. This is a lot. One of the most ambitious students throughout his life, Toby has been a model citizen. As his ambition continues to grow, his parents are starting to worry. Are we going to be able to go to all of them? Toby O'Hare. Nice to meet you. I'm Toby. Are you here to scan me? I'll try to do my best. Okay, doctor, can you tell me what you see on the screen? I hope you can make sense of it. Let's begin. A juicy, colossal fruit cut in half. They say you eat one colossal fruit a day. I eat mine for breakfast. I blend seven of them on Sunday and put them into bottles. It takes less time to consume. Bows to guidelines. Juice salesman. Okay, so that's fine. Heh, <laughs> looks like a structure, or sculpture I did when I was a kid. It was pretty good, but it actually no time for that kind of stuff nowadays. I never understood how some grown-ups have time for hobbies. Okay, no time for fun. Mm, my high school diploma? Scored 100. No one else did, so I... I'm pretty proud. Okay.
Calling Toby a perfectionist would be an understatement. This young man follows rules and guidelines as if his life depends on it. He is simply too good for his own good. I mean, I don't really see anything wrong with him. I don't see him as insane. Um, it's not my cup of tea, but like, I don't think he's crazy. He's fine. I don't. I don't think he's crazy. He's he's a little different, but not crazy. No further action required. Okay. Thank you. That's good. Right. I mean. Of course it is. Alright. A bit behind now, but that's okay. Yeah, he's just he's just a little different. Oh, okay. Well he do need to start sleeping. Uh there is that. Alright, let's go over here, see what she got going. Steffi Sparkle, a mind scanner. Uh I get it. Finally woke up and began criticizing our government and all of a sudden you show up incredible well okay let's rid my mind of my destructive thoughts okay <clears throat> the stun ray i saw the police use it on a street vendor once he hit the ground instantly imagine the chaos if everyone had one of those nasty things um okay so that's fine doesn't like police brutality. Ne neither do do the, do most of us. You know, some of us are crazy, but <clears throat> everyone's just standing there. What are they waiting for? They look like sheep, not me. I become I've become the shepherd. Um, hmm. I'm in between these two. I wonder what happens if we click awakened. That could be the constructor, con constructor, controlling everything from the gym makes me furious. A sinister style or a cold machine, only a few know what he or she actually looks like. Um, okay. The sparkle has developed a fantastical notion structure is not acting in her best interest she's clearly against the system this anti-structure behavior is a danger to our society <gasps> there is no, so okay um but she's not insane like i wouldn't call her insane just because she doesn't like the way y'all run stuff no no we ain't doing it we're not we're not she's fine she don't need nothing she's fine like you know, call me over here. There are real, there are real people out here thinking they're oak trees, and y'all are sending me over here for this. Yes, you're all right, Skinner. Sorry if I seemed angry before. I just feel like our society is going in the wrong direction. Like we should do something. I see you're doing your part. Sorry I distrusted you. I mean, I just, I don't think you're crazy. <laughs> like, like, cause she's not. I mean. I mean, she's just a person. Well, well, well. What a charming appearance. You've got confidence, haven't you, darling? I suppose we're, you're going to tell me my fortune now. Be quick about it. There are two... Something heading this way. Okay. Goat-like beast in leather armor. Vicious soldiers. I think we avoided them. Good. You were saying? Um, that you probably are crazy. No, this stuff has been growing in the city. I'm serious. I'm telling you now. If we allow it to spread, who knows what kind of diseases we'll catch? Is it real? Like, I don't know if that's real. I mean, is it real? Like, is that growing everywhere? I don't know how to, I don't know how to approach that because I don't know if this fungus is part of his books or if it's real. Like we know he a little loopy, but I don't know if this is real or not. And I don't really want to say that it's fictional. We'll just say nature lover. He knows something about nature. Okay. 
the inside of my old closet, my parents' closet. Often lost his temper, so none of his work started inside that closet. One time, a portal opened, but I did not dare to venture inside. Um, okay. Likes to hide. Oh. So it's basically trying to tell me my answers are wrong. A sandstorm, the kind you experience in the south here. I mentioned stuff for this. Mm. The kind you scrape off an engine. I'm sorry, I'm just kind of like... I don't really understand like what the... The kind you scrape off an engine after interstellar travel. That stuff is highly explosive if you don't know what you're doing. I don't know how it got stuck in my oven, but I need help clearing it. What? If it's something... Uh, okay. That's my son. I haven't seen him in ages. Ignores my warnings. The folly of youth. I'm just worried that he will be attacked by those flying... Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> So basically you have to pick the right one. Fiction is taking residence in the frontal lobe, clouding out reality. He suffers a dangerous and antisocial conviction that his stories are real. I mean, yeah. Eight types. Personality type. The dreamer. Awaiting treatment. Oh. Drugs. Yo, we didn't see all this. The outer zone. People live in the outer zone. Maintenance. Mind scanner. Okay. Initializing insanity panel. Okay. Initializing stress bar. Okay. Initializing personality bar. Okay. Patient stats uh, initialized, ready for treatment. Too much sanity may be madness, and the maddest of all to see life as it is and not as it should be. Untreatment, less and unstable. Avoid the red areas, or you'll stress your patient. If you want to develop another device, use the left panel to access the device manager. What? Yes. Choose a device that matches the insanity type of the patient. Okay. And oh, locked. Okay. Wow, what is that thing? Turn on device. How? Oh. Turn on the left eye. Left eye. Change the type of light to. Set rhythm to one. What? Change the type of light to this. Set the rhythm to three. Turn on the mouth. Turn off the device. Set 
set the rhythm to two. Turn off the left eye. Ooh, I'm gonna stress him out a bit. Time's up. Your workday has ended. Okay. This is Lena, Toby's friend. Weren't you supposed to help him? Toby's been hospitalized after a heart attack. Doctors say he worked too hard. He'll survive this time. But I'm worried about his future. I mean, he wasn't insane. <laughs> like, what? Like, you're mad because he works too much? Like, he's not insane, though. <laughs> further examine the nation. Letting her return home would be dangerous for her and everyone around her. She's doing well. You have nothing to worry about. She's an interesting subject. You should be proud. What? Okay, let's go back to him. I'm asking, which one of my books is your favorite? Um, Blast Off. Uh, the... Energetic type, are we? Then what do you think of the opening act? Be honest, Colt's decision to accept the duel was a bit of a stretch, no? Um, no. That's what I like to hear. When you think about it, Colt would never help the Outer Belt cruiser fleet if he was not entrusted by Duke's daughter. Go big or go home, I say. Okay. Let's get you... so scared. <laughs> is this gonna get more and more? Oh, it didn't move this time. That's good. Oh god. Treatment complete. Don't tell lies, grow up, make a living. Oh boy, I don't know if I like that. I forgot to mention a minor side effect of the treatments. They sort of reduce the personality of your patients. Once the personality is completely removed, it can never be recovered. But no worries, you'll get paid either way. Your insanity is for priority. It must be removed at any cost. I don't like that at all. Do not listen to the structure. They, you need to take care of your patients. Do not remove their personality. Keep treating, but treat with care. Right, yeah. Let's go see this person. Um, Oliver is a facts enthusiast. We can all learn from looking at data, but data or data, whichever one. But Oliver's insistence on following facts and logic has become a hindrance to his social performance. Alright, let's get over there. See what we can do. Hello, who are you? Oh, a mind scanner is it? I think your calculations might be off. I'm in no need of a mind scan, but if you insist, I will comply. I must learn something from this. Or I might learn something from this. Alright that you're crazy. No. Adams doing their close dance around each other. They aren't teaching us a moral lesson, just adhering to the laws of motion. Nothing changes when you zoom out. Hmm. It's the poster of one of those dad's dumb books. Look at the vulgar display. Some space maiden being abducted by a sentient intergalactic robot. It's just not plausible. Okay. 
a graph. Nice. Look how it jumps up and down. I like it when its shapes actually mean something. Um. No? Okay, well, I mean, that's what I got from that. Does my ex turn out to be just like the rest of them? All this talk about if in the future, abstract concepts, all that exists is what you do in the moment if you want to plan ahead, base it on facts. <clears throat> I mean, that's what it sounds like. It <laughs> sounds like he's got a lot of exes. My dad studied books everywhere. He would slave away all day in there, working on his junk fictions. Well, it was up to the rest of us to keep the house in order. Mm. Okay. Growing up in a house of fiction and tall tales led the younger Oliver to demand a solid grip of reality backed by hard data. This man has turned him into a square conformist. I don't... I mean, I feel like he needs to lighten up a little bit, but I just don't feel like he's that crazy. Logical Maniac, amount 11. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, let's go back. I don't know if we can maybe buy something for those. Um, if I were insane, I would know. I think the signs are pretty hard to miss, don't you? Look, I'm nothing like my father. Is this the son of the other guy? What was his name? I don't remember his name. Why can't we look? There. Yes, it is. Lewis. It was Lewis. Yeah, he was the one that we were talking to. So he's trying to not be like his dad. Well, your daddy ain't got no more personality, sweet, sweet boy. Um, that's what's going on there. Uh, we, we stripped him of everything. Like, we are trash, my guy. Do I want to do this? And lose the 25 though. I don't think so. He does have this one, so we'll do this. Oh, no. Oh, how do I? Oh, treatment. Yeah, that's right. Put my shit on. <laughs> um, set frequency to 15. Turn on the left eye. Change the light. Is that what that means? Like, there, there's no, like, X... Oh, are you supposed to press all of them? I don't really understand what that one's supposed to be. Rhythm to one. Zero. Okay. Are we- oh, so we can pass them. We just can't hit them directly. Okay. Okay. Time's up. Yo, we know that the truck is keeping your daughter from you. We can help you and we believe we can help. You can help us too. Just remember to take good care of your parents. Don't break the people, break the structure. Okay. Well, we're definitely breaking some people. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You take a bite of a delicious apple. The apple is filled with thousands of little maggots. They keep pouring out of the apple and out of your mouth. Gross. Brush your teeth. I just received 200 pages of 
complete and utter gibberish from Mr. Zansky. It's page after page of self-help advice. What did you do to him? We have a book fair coming up next month. Are you going to write the next installment of the moons under Nador Palace for us? Because someone sure needs to. Not my fucking problem. We must know the reason we've been contacted by a terrorist group known as Moonrise. These people seek to destroy a society and make it must be stopped. Have they contacted you? Who? Hmm. Okay. If you receive a message from them or any suspicious messages, you are obligated to tell us. We can make sure to protect you. For normality in the mind, the structure. All right, oh, fuck off. All right, let's go do this. So, how many patients do you treat per year? It would be interesting. Okay. Now is really not the time, sir. Uh, get get hooked up to this m machine, bruh. How do we, so if we want to stop though, we just, oh, we're just supposed to take that I guess. Cause he don't have no more personality, yo. Like, <laughs> I forgot I was supposed to be watching the personality bar, oh my god. I can zing. Oh, I can dig. I can dig it. It's a scream. I can smell what you're cooking if you catch my drift. Yeah, this is this cat is all right. Check it. Let's go. What the fuck are you? T <laughs> I call this one the outer zone. I'm taking a vacation, paid for by the boss in the gym. My trip is to the outer zone, the outer zone of love. Uh. I don't know. I don't know what any of that means. <laughs> like, none of that makes sense. My coworkers over at Sim Sim and Sons, real eggheads, just staring at me, not able to comprehend my words. Well, it's their loss. You snooze, you lose. Um. Okay. My talkie chip, post order, installed it myself, clicked it right in there, man. Yes, sir. They call me a cyborg. I call myself a seeker. Speech enhancement. My typewriter, a real classic beauty, but hey, the letters are all in the wrong order on this one. Good for some edgy montage work, I suppose. What? His automated speech center has overtaken his entire system. He lays an unbearable burden on his audience. Look, I'm just, I, I don't know what you're saying. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm over it. I'm over it, Alan. I'm over it. Okay. 
yeah it's it's a lot it's definitely a lot my guy my mind is poetic i see colors where others see black and white and uh infinity in a grain of sand if you want to call that insanity that's your loss man um no i just i can't with the uh with the uh with the stuff my guy i just can't with the stuff okay i just can't with the stuff oh gosh i always end up hitting it right there Day is done. Now, if you let them rest, will they get some of their like personality back? <clears throat> okay. How do I? But if I don't want to treat him anymore, I can't just not treat him now. And his personality is gone. Like, I don't know what else to do there. And it doesn't look like it comes back. He needs more rest because his stress bar is, like, high. Does it go down over time? Like, will he eventually not have stress? I have a lot of questions that aren't really, like, answered. <laughs> like, mind scanner, choose buttons. We have that. We know about that. And that. Drugs. Oh, so we need drugs. Ah, okay, so we could use the drugs to help with that stuff. Okay, so I could be buying the drugs, y'all, and saving the people. And I can give them the drugs and then they won't lose their personality and be stressed out at the same time. <sighs> oh my goodness. I can't believe I just figured that out. I'm s well, I mean, he don't have no more personality, so we can't save the one guy anyway. We can take, take the points away. And then he's no longer insane and we can get rid of some of his stress, I guess. Who knows why stuff happens? Just go with it. Yeah, you're, you've lost your mind. Okay. How do we... But if I want to use the drugs, how do I do that? Right? Like, so say, okay, I want to use the drugs. I want to give him this. How do I give him that, though? Because it's not in my thing. What is this? De-stress, pulser, indicator, knowledge harvester. Any insanity points. But we have drugs, so how do we give him drugs? You know what I mean? Sucker, removes all three. Removes, removes, removes. How do we give him the drugs is what I'm asking though. Because we have them, right? We don't need to buy anymore. How do we give them the drugs? It doesn't tell you how you give them the drugs. You just know that they're there. But how do I give them to him is my question. Do 
but I need to put them like over here. Oh, I need to put them in here. <gasps> Why y'all didn't say that? Is that is that what I need to do? And then I can be like, here you go. Take two of those. Does that help? And then take uh take one of these. And take one of these. There, you're done. Stress is down. Let's have some fun. Okay. Oh. You know. Let's travel here. So I needed to be like having the drugs on deck from jump. Okay, so this one, what was this one? Clarity. There's one insanity point. What was this one? This blocks any stress, and then this is the one to protect them. Okay. So. Okay. Alright. Stupid stress thing. <laughs> it's in such a weird spot too. Like, right, um, okay. So while the pill is on, that stuff goes away. And then what if I leave? Like what if I'm like, okay, that's enough for today. We're gonna go away. I feel like the stress thing should go down. It's part of the future. You mach your machine will let me see. Yes, sometimes I see ghosts of the future. I am wise, yes, but these visions are the main reason I share my thoughts. People need to know. The children of the structure need to learn about their future. Okay. Manifestation of brain cells connecting the gap between flesh and machine. Fascinating. It's so obvious. We need this. All of this. Transhumanist, I guess? Somewhere in the outer zone. Hmm. Curious. Mind scanning allows me to access access to places I'd never heard of before. What beautiful plants and strange creatures. Um. Oh. Okay. The system that maintains the structure supply. Such a fragile thing. Um. Chaos could happen. Uh, I see the wall collapsed. What kept our people in a closed loop is now open to the world. I say go with it. Tear those walls down. Let us breathe the air. Critical of boundaries? A girl, your daughter, I believe. In a containment unit made of a strange type of alloy, you should get her out. She is dangerous in the hands of the structure. God, they're gonna make me say it, aren't they? But I'm not gonna say she's insane. This leads to a loss of ego, which leads to a loss of personal responsibility. Her teachings are a threat to the community. No, they're not. Fuck y'all. <laughs> y'all think y'all just gonna take my daughter? Nah. Y'all don't even know how old she is. See? See? She doing something right. Fuck out of here. I'm just bullshit. No further action required. 
I love how they try to give you more. Uh, I struggle with the definition, but you are the professional here. Now, I shall go back to my work. I hope your future will be as good as the one I am aiming at. I mean, I don't really... Yeah, he's resting. I don't really have anywhere else to go, so... You want to end the day? Yes. End of day five. Y'all, I don't know. <laughs> is so weird i don't know what i'm doing wrong this is oliver's supervisor oliver has become a party animal his high logical skills have been replaced with a creative frenzy we had to fire him yeah we didn't do good on that one the worst thing is oliver never caused any trouble before you decided to treat him someone has to pay for this we'll tell the structure to pay for it whoops looks like this treatment wasn't necessary this must not happen again oh fuck it Here's a penalty for neglecting your duties. Had a rough day here. Have a cup of coffee. Compliments. No, thank you. Keep your eyes open when the time is right. We'll talk about it. Yeah, accept any birthday invitations. Y'all, okay. I'm gonna take a break here. There is so much going on that you're supposed to be looking at. And I didn't know that the drugs were like a thing that were gonna help me. I didn't realize what that was. So I think it would probably um, have changed the way some of this went if I realized that I could use those. <laughs> um, but it's an interesting game. It does remind me a lot of Papers, Please. I don't know if you've ever played that game. I have not personally played the game, but I have seen gameplay of it. It is very similar to this, um, where like a, a kind of like a group of people revolutionary group of people want to like overturn the government and you're like just doing your job kind of thing um no one's holding your daughter hostage so that's a new element but yeah i am um, i mean we'll see i guess <laughs> we we gonna see what the wild gonna bring as uh as my grandpa would say we're gonna wait and see what the wild gonna bring uh but yeah, no, it's an interesting game. And if you like this kind of stuff where it's like telling you a story where you're kind of just doing the same. Because I mean, let's face it, you're just going to be kind of doing the same task over and over and over again. Um, but I think it's good to, uh, I think it's, it's a good game. It's a good concept. And if it's something that you enjoy, then I say go for it. Yeah, full speed ahead. Um... Make sure that you LCS, like, comment, subscribe as always, and hit that notification bell. Like I said, these Wednesday videos are normally uploaded every Wednesday. Every now and then I take a break, but um, they are usually loaded up on Wednesday. But every now and then I will do kind of like a random upload just to see if y'all are paying attention. You're not, but um, yeah, you won't know if you don't turn on the notification. Okay, love you. Thanks. Bye.